No, um, no, I, I didn't want to fuss. I just wanted to pick up my passport. But... One passport. Yeah. What is it they say? If you really love someone, you let them go. Jane, you don't have to explain anything. I just wish you only good things, and I hope one day you can find it in your heart to forgive me. I've missed you so much. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, 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 everyone, I've got to go. Okay. Why are you running from me? to a dog without you being there. I mean, you're condemning him to a life of diabetes at the very least. Hell was that Ian sat by your bedside all but praying. You should be ashamed. I mean, the only thing that got him from Stephen's death and all the lies that went along with it was you, Jane, you. And now you just walk away. For no real, no understandable reason, you just walk away. Yeah, well, I always said there was a nasty streak. Your smiles, your flowers. You never fooled me. Will it be on your conscience, will it? It'll be on your head, Jane. Why don't you shut your fat mouth? The whole time I've known you, you've acted like you've got the right to pass judgment on me whenever you feel like it. But you didn't spend half of Ian's adult life playing Ted Cuppy. Yeah, well, I had no choice. I was forced to. Hang on, no way. Someone's, someone ain't making you do this, are they? No. Well, then you go, Jane. You go and don't come back. I still love you. 